Hi, it's Kerry. Join me on the farm today as we look at some new farm animals. Please share my videos. It really helps. The black bull. Bulls are more muscular and aggressive than the female of the species, the cow. They have thicker bones, larger feet and a very muscular neck. A large bony head with protective ridges over the eyes. The Black Angus Bull. This breed was introduced into the United States in 1873 and after that date its influence spread widely there and in other countries. The Black Angus Cow. The cattle are very hardy and can survive typically harsh winters with snowfall and storms. And the calf. The cattle are naturally polled and black in colour. Polled means no horns. They originated in the northeast of Scotland. This one. They are graceful, long necked, heavy bodied, big footed birds that glide majestically when swimming and fly with slow wing beaks and with necks outstretched. And here are the signets. The duck. Notice that the legs are placed rearward as in swans rather than forward as in geese. The result is a distinctive waddling gait. Mandarin duck. They have long claws and are the most arboreal of ducks, often roosting in trees. The ducklings. Ducks are divided into three major groups the dabbling or shallow water ducks, diving ducks, and perching ducks, based on their characteristic behaviours. The mallard is an example of a dabbling duck. kittens with their red ball of wool. Much of the play of kittens and other young predators serves to develop hunting skills. My farm dog Sam. The white rabbit. The long ears of rabbits are most likely an adaption for detecting predators. The angora rabbit. It has silky delicate white fibre for its fur. It is prized for its fineness, soft texture and luster. The fibre is used mainly for high quality woven fabrics, knitted goods and knitting yarns. The ram is a male sheep. It is a ruminant which means culturing mammal of the genus Ovis. The sheep is usually stockier than its relative the goat. The ewe, the female sheep. A sheep regurgitates its food and chews the cud, thus enabling its four separate stomach compartments to thoroughly digest the grasses. The lamb. Animals prefer grazing on grass or legume vegetation that is short and fine, though they will also consume high coarse or brushy plants as well. The llama is a South American member of the camel family. It is closely related to the alpaca and vicuna, which are known collectively as lamoids. When annoyed, they are known to spit. The llama is primarily a pack animal, but is also used as a source of food, wool, hides, tallow for candles and dried dung for fuel. Most herds of llamas are maintained by the Indians of Bolivia, Peru, Ecuador, Chile and Argentina. The boa nanny goat and kid. 
They are a breed of South African goat. The most prized boa goats are large stocky animals with a white body and a red brown head, brown eyes, lop or downward hanging ears, backward curving horns and strong well placed legs. Boa does, the females, are renowned for kidding as often as two times in three years, frequently bearing twins and sometimes triplets. The Black Forest Horse family, the Stallion, Mare and Foal. They are a breed of light draft horse from the Black Forest of Southern Germany. The Black Forest Horse is always chestnut in colour with a flaxen mane and tail. The coat varies from pale to very dark, sometimes almost black. This draft horse is light to medium weight, well muscled and with a short and powerful neck. It has a broad and muscular anatomy. Tap the bell icon to be notified when my next new video is uploaded. There's lots of other goats in the red barn. Subscribe and like if you like farm animals. Thank you for watching my video. Please share with your friends. See you again soon.